Welcome back to Peace, Love and Tarot. This reading is for Libra, Sun, Moon or Rising and it's the week in focus reading for the week beginning March 18. So Libra, your cards for this week are in the position of energies leaving, completing or transitioning, Five of Pentacles, focus energies are Knight of Wands and Eight of Wands and we've got the Six of Cups coming up and coming in sorry, at the end of the week. So Libra, it looks like you feel like you've been doing it pretty hard lately. Um, might have a bit of a, a lack or scarcity mindset going on. You're literally feeling like you've been left out in the cold. Uh, looking at the rest of the spread here, I'm going to I'm going to call this as you feel like you've been left out in the cold in love. You feel like you know you're in a poverty state of mind when it comes to love. You know to the point that you're actually feeling cold-hearted you know you're feeling like you really need that um, internal warmth that love brings to you um, you can see the characters in the card are you know clearly poor and um, probably hungry and out in the cold uh, but you know just behind them is the church here indicating that everything that they are seeking is really like an accessible reach to them so even if you may have been feeling like you've been in a scarcity situation when it comes to matter of matters of the heart it's really only a matter of opening your heart where you can invite that in and by applying your own self-love you know you actually um, create that energy even more so that you create a, sorry let me say that again you actually put that energy out there so then you can um, accept or receive that energy back and that is exactly what is going to happen by the looks of things. Um, so things look like they're going to shift up pretty quickly this week, guys. You've got the Knight of Wands with the Eight of Wands here. So both of these cards um, indicate a swift change. And together, I would just say that, that you know it could even be something quite instantaneously happening for you. So um, Eight of Wands can also indicate travel. So it could be travel or it could just be an extremely swift change. Um, the Knight of Wands is, you know, he rides in with the, the lusty passion kind of heat and fire and adventure. So I really think that, you know, it's interesting because it's almost the total opposite energy of what's going on in this card. In this card you've got, you know, the, the cold and the isolation and the poverty and here we've got just lust and passion like riding on and on and on a horse so I think it could be somebody coming in um, Knight of Wands fire sign it could be a Leo Sagittarius or Aries um, it's going to be a swift change lots of passion lots of lust and um, with the six of cups coming in towards the end of the week guys this could be somebody from your past coming back somebody potentially that you knew during your childhood um, you could actually be traveling to see this person or they could be traveling to see you. So yeah, it definitely looks like somebody coming in. And you know, the feeling is it's a lot of it's it's happy, you know, it's um it's all flowers and, and and sunny feelings. And if you compare even these two cards, your two bookends, what total different energy have we got here? You know, we've got two characters here out in the cold, not facing each other, just plodding along and just trying to get through, trying to get to the next meal, trying to warm their warm their toes. And here you've got two characters just, you know, in in embracing each other and facing each other and feeling those warm, fluffy feelings. So guys, looks like you're doing a total 180 this week. It's going to happen quickly. So I think um, that's pretty exciting news for you, especially if you've been feeling this Five of Pentacle energy for a little while. So guys, keep in mind this is a general reading. It doesn't mean to say this is going to happen for everybody, but the p potential is there for it. And those of you will know who you are that this message is meant for. So um, Libra, good luck with that. Comment on the video if you feel this resonated for you, and we'll see you next week.